Welcome to the School of Humanities, Arts, and Cultural Studies at Arizona State University's West Campus. The arts and humanities help us make sense of it all, people, ideas, cultures. As we move through these understandings and strive to make sense of this world, we prepare students to help them understand what makes us human. We find ways to make the world a better place. This is what we do at the School of Humanities, Arts, and Cultural Studies. Humanities are important because they help us understand and appreciate the world around us. We're shaped by our past, by our history, and it helps us to understand ourselves and others. The arts and humanities teach you to be a better thinker, a better creative thinker, and a better critical thinker. The humanities help us understand the fast-changing world we live in. The humanities give us the tools to imagine the future. The humanities matter because people in our world matter. The arts and humanities are something that everybody should study. They made me a better communicator. The arts and humanities give you an opportunity to think about important topics that make life worth living. In the humanities, we guide students to discover creative interdisciplinary frameworks for thinking about our lives and subsequently their careers. We think it's important to study a particular discipline so students can formulate discipline-centered questions which impact the answers they encounter. Every discipline is defined by a specific set of methods. When a student learns to ask questions through the lens of their particular discipline, they gain a measure of expertise before branching out and learning how other disciplines answer similar questions. Philosophy majors are well equipped to succeed in a variety of fields. Law, medicine, education, the business world, nonprofit work, and journalism, amongst many others. In philosophy, religious studies, and society, we go beyond the traditional philosophy degree and emphasize the practical role philosophy can play in everyday life. Students discover topics that help to enrich the human experience. They learn to ask questions like, what does it mean to be virtuous? What is knowledge? What is the human good? Does God exist? Why or why not? What is the best political system for a society to undergo? What are my objective moral values and how do I find those out? And how do I apply them? We live in a society where we're constantly bombarded with messages, political, commercial, cultural, that work to influence our hearts and minds. To be able to read and communicate well, and I don't just mean being able to decipher a text, but to understand its social and historical context and to position it within these larger structures of meaning is absolutely crucial to working and living in this message-saturated environment. Within the 10 research clusters in the School of Humanities, Arts, and Cultural Studies, students have an opportunity to study and ponder and to make sense of important questions of the human condition. In English, we're teaching change. Changes concerning climate, borders, the struggle for black lives, technology, economic inequality, health and disability, or gender and sexuality. Literature accompanies change. Writers of poetry, fiction, and nonfiction are agents of and witnesses to the changes that make and remake our world. Hi, I am Nicole Piamonte, and I have a bachelor's in English from the New College, as well as a master's in communication studies and advocacy. And now I am the assistant dean for medical education at Creighton University School of Medicine here in Phoenix. So when I think about the humanities and what that education means and, and what they do in this world, I think they should be studied just for the sake of studying them because they're inherently good. Studying the humanities does something. It changes people. They offer new perspectives of the world. They give language to questions that seem completely unanswerable. Our students make change. They find their voices in order to convey their ideas 
in public policy, community organizations, and the corporate world. Hi, my name is Alexis Hermosillo. I'm a graduate from ASU's West Campus from the New College with a degree in Interdisciplinary Arts and Performance, and I am now the mayor of El Mirage, Arizona. Going to college is the best decision that anyone can make. The doors that open, the experiences that you have, the people that you meet, the growth that you experience in college and from that college experience is going to launch you into a direction that you'll never have imagined for yourself. Students who major in IAP receive extensive preparation for careers as artists, performers, and creative professionals. They develop solid foundations useful for professional and entrepreneurial opportunities. IAP engages in practical and theoretical studies of visual, sonic, performance, game, and interactive arts. IAP is about versatility, taking creativity to the next level. Students create works of art showcased at Artspace West, performing at Second Stage West, directing short films, recording in the music studio, and developing impactful toys and games. IAP is pushing the edge. The Social and Cultural Analysis Program offers six concentrations that include American Studies, Ethnic Studies, Women and Gender Studies, Peace Studies, and Queer and Sexuality Studies. All of our classes grapple with the creation, maintenance, and resistance to systems of privilege and power, and how power is unequally distributed and maintained in our society. Classes in Social and Cultural Analysis focus on topics as diverse as migration, media images, manifestos, sexual practices, social movements, narrative cultures, and social identities, among many others. We are at a critical historical juncture where we have to rethink and reorganize the ways in which the cultures of the world interact with each other. We are globally interconnected. This is a time when creativity is demanded and a call to action is imperative. With the arts and humanities, we're studying the problems of the world today to make the world better tomorrow.